Hello everybody and welcome back to Minecraft Dungeons. My name is Tolkien Force and at last we did the ah, we did the Lone Fortress and now we're going to do the Lost Settlement. Um, before that we did the Fortress Fjord and maybe next episode we'll do a daily trial. I don't know. Uh, we got the Ice Wand which is pretty cool. I don't think I want to use it. It's 109. I kind of like my combo. Uh, we got this really cool light uh, Lightning Harp Crossbow and we have some Snow Armor. I don't know if I want to... Uh, protection, gravity pulse. I don't like gravity pulse. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna use this armor ever. So I'm probably just gonna get rid of it. So there's that. Uh, my blacksmith. I still got you know two more to go. But I'm not using those for right now anyway. So let's start it off with the lost settlement. So man, come on. You can give me a better loading screen than this. All right. There was no intro. <laughs> uh, what am I looking at? Seven chests, one secret. So that's not too bad. There we go. Let's just blow these fellas up. And I love it when I do the blowing up and they're not blowing me up. It's noteworthy because I don't like to die. Who does? Also, sliding around on the ground can be really, really annoying. But, if you got the speed boost and you're not being affected by slowness or chilling or whatever the ice thing that people put on you is, sometimes it can be really beneficial. <laughs> but for now, I'm just going to kill all these guys and it's going to be fun. I do have to go up though. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, crap. <sighs> the level up actually just saved my life. I wasn't getting enough radiance to heal myself fast enough because they all had like... They were just hurting me. Can I go in here? Oh, that's just the light. I thought there was like a door there. Nothing? Nothing. Let's go up. Activate the bridges. I will think about it. I'm gonna pop that healing potion right now. I'm hoping nothing's gonna start hurting me. Uh, there was so many fish and breads and pork or whatever it is that was on the ground. I didn't have to pop the potion. I just figured I'd give my, uh, if I popped the potion, then my potion would have time to heal. Oh, I missed. I want to see these red, these green redstone lamp things. I want to see those in the main game. And I've said it once before. I've said it twice before. I've said it more than twice before. I want to see a lot of the things that Minecraft Dungeons, like, shows in the actual game. Oh, wait. I just entered into an arena. Let's just pop that now. There we go. Don't worry about that thing. Take these guys out. Make it nice and quick. I don't know if putting on Infinity on this bow was worth it. I could have put on something else that wasn't infinity it just depends on how often they use the arrows oh it was a fuse shot um it already explodes on it Ooh, a flail a 110 flail i already had a flail i had a flail down here it's another 110 flail well maybe it has better enchantments i don't know i don't really use flails uh where am i supposed to go Oh yeah, my crossbow had fuse shot on it that I could have put instead of the infinity, but it already explodes on impact. But the arrow might explode again. I don't know, and I'm and I double explosions is pretty good to me. Oh my goodness, that was one shot. Yeah, take them all out. I haven't seen a uh, an illusion or an oh. I haven't seen an illusioner in a while. I wonder if they'll spawn. I mean, I'm sure they spawn. I'm sure it's just a random chance of them spawning. Like the Endermen are or whatever. They just have a potential to spawn in like certain spots. I have no idea. And I know I was saying how I want to see a lot of mobs in the main game. I do not want to see the guy who throws ice on you in the main game. That is somebody I don't really want to see. <laughs> I don't really have a way to speed up like I do in this game, in the main game. 
Which means I feel like I would be getting hit for like four hearts and getting stunned like all the time if those guys were actually in the game. Or maybe if they were only to show up in like, I don't know, raids or something. That might be kind of cool. Alright, we're good there. Oh, 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 all right, we're good, we're good. Don't blow up on me, don't blow up on me. We're good. Alright, some of us are good. Oh my goodness. The ice! <laughs> sometimes the ice works in your favor and sometimes it does not. <laughs> Alright, I wonder how long this level is. It is one of the secret levels, which makes me think it's not going to be as long as, like, some of the other levels. It definitely doesn't seem as difficult. But that might be because I'm using weapons and, like, abilities and things like that that I'm really comfortable with. I have no idea. This isn't even the way I'm supposed to go. I did all this for spelunking armor. <laughs> Whatever. All right, let's go to the right. I think that's the way we're supposed to go. Yeah, like, what if these guys... I don't know what they're called. The the guys who throw the ice on you. If they were to only, like, show up in, like, raids at snow villages. Instead of, like, vindicators. Vindicators? Evokers. Evokers. Not vindicators. Vindicators can show up wherever they want to show up. But, like, if these guys were to show up instead of... Um, If they were to show up instead of the evokers. In snow villages. Snow village raids. I think that that might be pretty good. I don't know how you program something like that, but I'm sure somebody can figure it out. Am I even going the right way? I mean, I know I'm not going the right way. But, like... Nah, I'm just gonna go back. Um, so I'm not going the right way. But I found, you know, Cutlass and this little area. Makes me think this is the secret! Maybe not. I didn't count as the secret. Man, I'm getting tons of emeralds. Spawner who? There's no spawner there. <gasps> what is that? What was that? All I did was touch it. And I don't know if I touched it or if I hit it, but I definitely collected it somehow. Dang. I don't know about you guys, but I think this game is a lot of fun. The thing is, is like you have to really like dungeon crawlers to want to just want to grind out levels for armor and things like that. Where I have a lot of fun with this, but like when they stop having updates and stuff, then it just becomes really repetitive. And, I mean, I play some pretty repetitive games. Um, dungeon crawlers usually aren't one of them. But that does not mean that I do not appreciate the dungeon crawler from now and again. I just have a hard time staying committed to a dungeon crawler, if you know what I'm saying. Ooh, I pressed that button. What do these buttons do? Alright, I finally found the way I'm supposed to go. Explore the forest. Don't mind if I do. What does that sound? Did you hear that? It sounded like it was like over here. Also, these redstone lamps... Pretty cool. Um, I did see some redstone lamps like hanging from a uh, like a fence kind of thing up in the air. I don't know how it's powered. Because you can make it look nice. Then I'd use redstone lamps more. There we go. No more freezing effect for me. Does that kill anybody? I was thinking, I was really hoping that there was going to be a big old group of people just spawn right next to that door. Alas, not the case. But you can see what I'm saying about, like, things getting repetitive. Ooh, TNT. Oh, it's dynamite. Eh. Because it really is all just kind of the same thing. You know, killing a guy here, smacking a guy over there, exploding a guy over this direction. Nothing over here. Oh! Oh no! I'm actually gonna die! I don't wanna die! I'll take out these enchanters. Oh no! No! 
Oh no! Oh my goodness! Ugh, just for a freaking thing of fox armor. I think the emeralds were worth more than that. Actually, that's not true, because I can salvage the fox armor. Or the wolf armor, sorry, whatever. You know what I mean. The fox armor is just the legendary version of the wolf armor. Ooh, an obsidian chest. With wolf armor. What's the point? Ugh. I'm sure there's always a point for something. Would have liked a nice thing of snow armor, though. Is that all that's over here? Probably. I guess I could check behind that building, but... Nah. I made it to where I need to be, again. And there's a big old horde of people. Just, oh my gosh. I need, oh, oh my goodness, where's the illusioner? There's so many people and I don't know who's who. Oh, I need that strength potion. Thank you. Thank you, oh no, 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 no. Back up. Ah, you're not gonna be the one that kills me. Stupid Vindicator. Ugh. No! Dang it! <laughs> oh, did I get him? I think I might have just got him. I got a dark armor from that. Is dark armor good? Let me look. It's not even a legendary. It's not even worth my time. There are a lot of people here. There's also a pig over here that I kind of want to get. Oh, ooh, ooh, watch out for that. Pick up that dynamite. There we go. I need to, I need to blow some people up. Oh no, boxes go. No, I don't think that bo I don't think that dynamite hit anybody. Oh, I think it hit like two people. We'll keep freaking here. Oh my gosh. If I get stunned, I'm screwed. Those like, those things up in the air, those are like my, okay, well, I can't really hit him if he's kind of glitched underneath the thing. But yeah, those, those floating ice cubes, those are my number one priority to like, avoid. <laughs> Man, this is actually a longer level than I thought it was gonna be. And I think this is the final area. Activate the relic. That's gonna lock behind me as soon as I activate it. I know it, I just, I mean, I know it. It's just how it's gonna be. How do I activate them? Oh, is there a button? Cool. Oh, it's like a, kinda looks like a clock. Ooh. Is there pork there I can eat? Oh, nice, okay. These enchanters, they've gotta go. I am, I am absolutely not gonna get caught with enchanters enchanting everybody, making it difficult for me. I just don't wanna have it. I don't wanna deal with it. Yeah, get rid of you. Take these guys out over here. No big deal. That was the easiest thing I've ever done in my entire life. Activate stage two. Oh, it comes in stages. Are there four stages? There better not be four stages. I wasn't missing anybody. Activate stage three. I'll activate them right now. Where is it? Where's the button? Ooh, illusioner. You, it's this one. Yeah. Yes, that is the fastest I have ever killed an illusioner. I think there's a way that you can tell which one is the illusioner. And it's the one who spawns first. So as long as you can actually catch him, spawning, or moving or something, then I think you'll be okay. But it can be a little difficult sometimes. They're tricky. Nice, the settlement is safe. Looking good. And there it is. Lost in the snow. Lost in the snow. Da -da 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 -da. All right. Anything good from the chest? Better be something good. Let's go over here. See if we've done this. Yep, two out of. Th yeah, two out of three. 
So, in the next episode, so we've already done the Frosted Fjord, the Lone Fortress, and the Lost Settlement. In the next episode, what we're going to do is we're going to do some daily trials. We're going to do at least probably one. I'm not sure how they work, but I'll make sure that I do one that gives me a chance of one of these legendary armors because, or, sorry, unique armors, whatever, mythic armors, legendary, who cares? The max armor that you can get. I'll make sure to do one of those daily trials. Probably this one and the thing. Well, it's daily, so I probably won't do that. I don't know. Whatever pops up, I'll do a daily trial next episode. And then I guess I'll do some more episodes when more DLCs come out. Not 100% sure how it's all going to work. But actually, before I leave this episode here, I think I want to buy a mystery merchant. Random melee weapon. Random melee weapons. 107 to 113. 107 to 113. Here, let me move my camera over to this way. It's 300 coins. And this is just a random item in general. So, yeah, let's do a random melee weapon. Let's see if it's any good. It wasn't. <laughs> let's see if uh, the random melee weapon. No. Random. Other item. Whatever. Let's just buy them all. They're all trash. <laughs> One of these things uh, pay to restock. I have to pay to restock the item? Fine. I just wasted so many emeralds. What's the luxury merchant got for me? Trash. He's got trash for me. What's this village merchant got for me? More trash. Come on. Friends, bring me something. Give me something. Uh, blacksmith. I need my items back. Whatever. Either way, guys, if you liked it, you know what to do. Uh, I'll see y'all in the next episode. Have a good one.